I'm Lance Corey. This is Galen Anderson. Uh, it's January 26, 2020. We are hitting the road on a 900 mile round trip. Uh, could be 1500. You never know with us. Uh, but we're going to head out this morning. Where are we going? So the goal is to get to uh, Mount Charleston in Nevada. Uh, it's about 40 minutes outside of Vegas, but we're going to run up through Death Valley side, take the long way in. Uh, that's our goal. You ready to do this? Always ready. Stay tuned. Let's go. Later. Well, we made it to Mojave. Uh, it's a little chilly. Got a little cold out there. Right, right. Yeah, we're uh, going to head into some colder weather, so I'm actually going to put a jacket on now. Right, okay. See you at the next stop. What's up? We're uh, here in Atlanta. Uh, got snow on the mountains still. It's uh, a little chilly still out here, but uh, we're ready to get into the Death Valley scene. Yeah, Death Valley. We're gonna go ride right through like there. <laughs> <laughs> About 200 miles under our belt. Nice day out though. Really cool. Well, we're at the entrance to Death Valley, and it's a little bit of wind. Call me 55. Snow on the Sierra. A little bit of snow on the mountain over there. High desert. Yeah. So, see you in Panama Springs. Yeah, we're going to head over the hill and get a burger. to eat. Not much left of the burger. Hey y'all, what's up? Where are we at, Lance? Panaman Springs. Yep, you gotta stop by this little joint. Good burger, beer, little bowl of split pea soup. Hit the spot, man. Yeah, now we gotta hit the road because we gotta go over that mountain over there. Get to Rhylite. Next stop, show you a little funky town. Ghosty. Yes, sir. Lighting. here in Rhyolite Ghost Town, Nevada. Interesting little spot, cool to see. This town was established in 1905, and by 1907 they had lights, electricity, and 1911 they closed the town down. <laughs> Crazy. The ride through here is amazing though. Unbelievable. Sea level, up in the mountains, you name it, it's there. And then you got these dudes hanging out. This is what Rhyolite's famous for. We gotta be really careful on the road. Hey, what do we got there? These dudes are here. Hey, there's a couple asses. <laughs> I mean, there's two asses and two donkeys, man. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? How you doing, huh? We've 
been uh, staying at the uh, Exchange Club Motel. They're building some new stuff, and right across the street here, we'd walk over here to the Happy Burrow Chilean Beer. Hey, follow me, guys. Come on and check this place out. I think you're gonna dig it. <laughs> There she is. Yeah. yeah. I respect that so much. We do this dig place, it. man. <laughs> I take this place. You got your baggers and dirt bikes. We're up in Bay, Nevada. We made it up here. Cheers. Uh, we still are going to head out. We got about, uh, let's see. An hour and a half, and we'll be at Mount Charleston for dinner. Literally ride maybe an hour. Right, there you go. <laughs> All right. See you guys. Lights. Should we stay here tonight? Uh, I think we'll keep riding a little longer. So we just finished 420 miles today, uh, went up to 14, 395, uh, where'd we end up? Well, we made it to Mount Charleston in Nevada, so, you know, it took us a little longer than expected, but hey, we're trying to shoot some video for you guys. We just rode through 25 degree weather, we're trying to find breakfast up here on Mount Charleston. So this is day two. Uh, Gonna try to hit the Valley of Fire, uh, down to Boulder City, go around Lake Mead, down to Boulder, then go through the Mojave Dunes. Uh, be home tonight, 509, 550 miles, something like that. Total trip of about a thousand miles. Go check it out. Yes, sir. It was awesome. It's great. Yeah, um, look, run through Mojave. I don't know. It's yeah. something about the desert, you know. I love the desert. <clears throat> I really do. Yeah. So we cruised through Mojave. We got up to on the 395, which is right now this time of year is epic. Yeah. Snowcap mountains. And then blasting up over uh, Death Valley into that valley. It's got snow-capped mountains right now. It's uh, green. I was really hoping that jet would come through. You know, every yeah. time we've gone through there, that thing just comes sailing down through the canyon. It's just epic. Yeah, that is definitely cool. Yep. Then our old favorite, Beatty. Yeah. End up in Beatty. Yeah. Happy Burrow. Had a beer there. Yeah. That was cool. I, for some reason, I, I love coming out of, out of Death Valley and then coming up and seeing Rhyolite. So I, I just love that old ghost town kind of buildings and feel. Yeah, that was definitely cool. There's so many of those places in California to look at too. Right? It's just crazy. But yeah. well, that was great desert run through there too. That was also Area 51. Right. Like, yeah. yeah. Where the alien truck stop. Yeah, that's good. Seven, it was a little dark, a little cold. Yeah, uh, yeah. But you know, those thrashing gauntlet gloves like 28 degrees 25 degrees nothing yeah it's, it's snow great. it's cold it's fun we're at mount charleston now 8,000 feet a little breakfast we're gonna head out of here uh probably go to uh what, valley of fire yeah. see where we're going and yeah. then lake mead and then home yeah. 500 mile day i don't know we got a thousand mile trip on that bed. heading into the valley of fire so check it out. We were at Mount Charleston this morning. It was 25 degrees, 8,000 feet. And now we're down. And that was 40 minutes outside of Vegas. Is that what it was? Yeah. 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 And then, you know, we go the other direction and we're in the Valley of Fire, which is like 35 minutes outside of Vegas. Dang. Now we're going to go check out Lake Mead. Yeah, it's going to be epic. Which is down that way. You gotta get a close up of that outhouse. We both use. <laughs> <laughs> the things you see on these trips. Amazing. Hey, you see the wild board here? Yes. <laughs> More wildlife this trip than ever.
The lake is so low. So we made it out to Lake Mead. What an amazing ride through Valley of Fire, around Lake Mead, and this road we've never been on. You're out in the middle of nowhere and the, the terrain changes and changes and changes. So worth it. Yeah, you guys from Vegas that are out here, uh, this is a gem, this North Shore Road. Paved well, great twisties, great sweepers, great turns all the way, all the way around. And you know, we're sitting here at Lake Mead. Uh, you can maybe see the water line, how low it is. It's 134 feet below where it, where it should be as normal full pool. So a lot of, a lot of water to, to be made up here, but epic, epic ride. You never know who you'll meet. tourist attraction. A couple from India is cruising around on this mega, unbelievable thing to see. And what do they do? They want to sit on our Harley Davidsons. <laughs> yeah! But we're also lucky we got on the Hoover Dam because the security asked us if we were carrying guns yeah. or any weapons. I left mine in the last saloon. I do have weapons. I just <laughs> told them I didn't. <laughs> and we end up in this town called Nipton. Nipton in the middle of nowhere. It's like a square block with a bunch of funky stuff like giant octopus, teepees, tents. Hey, Big Lance, what are you going to tell us today? Well, first of all, I want to thank everybody for joining us on our uh, Death Valley, uh, Vegas, and home and everywhere in between journey. That was episode one. Uh, several more to come. If you subscribe on the button below, Tulane Life, um, you can follow us. We're going to have informative videos on travel, how to take care of your bike, gear, all the cool things you need. It's just going to be a lot of fun. We want you to see where we go. We do this all the time. We know the spots. Yeah, we're real excited to launch this, uh, take this passion that we have for writing and, and share it with you. We're also going to be launching the website, TulaneLife.com. Uh, we'd love you to go out and look at that. We'll have our affiliates on there. Uh, those are our sponsors that, and the equipment that we run. i uh, will show you links to that. Uh, we'll have informative uh, interactive maps so you can see the destinations we've gone on and, and you too can go take those uh, and hopefully enjoy the, the run as much as we do. Uh, hopefully you'll see some little little spots that we go to, restaurants, uh, bars and, and things that uh, you can also stop in and enjoy. So join us. Uh, we're excited to launch this brand. We're Too Late take, Life. Take you to some cool places. Yep.